Josiah, you made it. We're here. I'm so excited to have this conversation with you today. Yeah, I'm pumped, man. Thanks for having me here. Of course. We're going to talk about a lot of stuff today just because we share a similar thing, which is we are Christian content creators and you are also now very involved at the church, which I'd love to talk to you about as well today. And I'd love to start off with how we met and if you could share that story. Yeah, Loki crazy. So uh, yeah, so I've been making Christian content for the last four years, started in 2019, uh, started taking off in 2020 during COVID. Uh, and then all of a sudden, I think it was 2022 was when I was just like, man, I, I wanna start connecting with other Christian content creators. And so I was I was watching videos and, and I'm a student of the game. And so I used to watch these YouTube videos of a guy named Robert Benjamin. And one of his videos, he would give these tips on how you can work the algorithm, hashtags and all of the different applicable things for social media. And then all of a sudden he had this clip of a guy who does prayers and who makes prayer videos. And I was like, wait, hold up real quick. I like paused the video and I saw this thing said lit with prayer. So I started following you <laughs> on social media. And then all of a sudden, uh, by random, I mean, not random, that, by divine connection, uh, someone, a mutual friend had said, Hey, you're out in Arizona. Um, I have a friend who's out there who makes Christian content. He's out there in Arizona too. Where are you at? I said, I'm in Scottsdale. And they're like, oh, they're in Scottsdale too. They also go to a church called Impact Church. I'm like, wait, hold up. This dude is closer than I know. So I immediately message you. And then we have coffee that first time. Y'all, this is crazy. Cause if you remember, like, I thought you were a straight mega star dog. I sat down and I was like, this dude's a celebrity. Cause I'm, I'm like, you're doing what I, I love to do. Yeah. And you were doing it at a high level. And I was just like, well, I want to learn from this dude. And then from that conversation, we recognize, man, we think so much alike. Mm -hmm. There are so many similarities that we have with one another and that's how this relationship was built, bro. I'm super grateful for you. You keep me encouraged and in the game because the game can get crazy sometimes. Oh, yeah. But I love being in the trenches with you. Yeah. And it's it's so funny to hear your perspective of that, because when I sat down with you, I was just as excited to see you because in my mind, I thought, I don't know anyone else who does what I do. And it's lonely because you it's lonely in the beginning. Because you, not that you don't have believers in your life, you just don't have those believers in your life who are doing what you're doing. So being able to sit down with you and see what your content was, I remember when you were, because I looked at your content and I was seeing what you were doing when we initially connected before we even sat down to have coffee. And when you showed me the style in which you were doing, I sat there and was just, I knew that was going to do so well. And here we are what is it, maybe two years later, and God has just blessed your ministry so much. You've gone on to impact so many. Guys, this guy's got more followers than me on Instagram. He's reaching more people than me. But we know it's not about that. It's about just feeling called from the Lord to do something. So I'm just so excited to do life with you because you are, in my opinion, the closest Christian content creator I know, which I feel I could call you anytime. We have had hours and hours and hours of chats, going to conferences together, all the different opportunities. And now where we are here in this studio, both building podcasts at the same time to continue to just ask God, what else can you do to share the message that you put on our hearts? So yeah, 